The process of DNA replication in E. coli begins at a region of the bacterial chromosome called the origin of replication. The origin consists of an AT-rich region adjacent to sequences that are recognized by the DNA binding protein, DNAA. The binding of DNAA to the DNAA boxes initiates a process that leads to an opening of the AT-rich region. The replication bubble in the DNA molecule is opened further by helicase, and the replication forks at each end of the bubble are expanded. Single-strand binding proteins then attach to each single-stranded DNA molecule to stabilize the open bubble, and subsequently topoisomerases bind to relieve the supercoiling of the double-stranded DNA created by the unwinding of the strands. RNA primers are synthesized by the enzyme called DNA primase. To make the two leading strands, single primers are synthesized at the origin. DNA polymerase 3 then extends each primer by synthesizing a daughter strand of DNA in the 5' prime to 3' prime direction as it moves toward the replication fork. Each lagging strand is made in the direction away from the replication fork. DNA primase synthesizes short RNA primers, and then DNA polymerase extends the primers by synthesizing a short segment of the daughter strand called an Okazaki fragment in the 5' prime to 3' prime direction until it reaches the RNA primer from the previously made Okazaki fragment. DNA polymerase 1 removes the primer and fills in the vacant region with DNA. Finally, two adjacent Okazaki fragments are ligated together by DNA ligase.